What's up guys? H. DeMarzo here from the Tech Cruiser channel. It's been a while since I've been with you guys, done a video. So I decided that the big news that we have today is as good a time as any to go ahead and start doing videos once again. So in the news recently, if you haven't already heard, Facebook is buying Instagram. Uh, Instagram, if you're not an iPhone user, is a photo sharing kind of social app. You can take pictures and, and share them with uh, with various networks, uh, various social networks that you're part of, and you can comment and and forward and share you know other people's photos that you find interesting. Um, so Facebook is buying this app, this service, for a billion dollars. That's a lot of zeros, a uh, billion dollars. So there's a lot of people on both sides of the fence, uh, for it and against it. Me personally, I, I don't really, I haven't really used Instagram much. I used it maybe once or twice to just check it out. Uh, it's a good app. It's a good service, but for me, in you know, in my use, in my life, it's just, it's just another, um, it's just another social network, another. You know, social networking app to use or to keep track of. Um, so I don't really use it as much. But there are a lot of people who do swear by it. So, so again, mixed reviews. Uh, a lot of people against it. Also, um, you know, there's the fact that Facebook is acquiring another service, becoming a little bloated. Um, there's also the privacy concerns that Facebook has acquired over the uh, the past couple of years, and so with all that bundled up, um, it, it leaves the question: Is this going to be a good merger, or is this going to be a bad merger? Um, personally, I I feel like it uh, it may be a little much. You know, like it's just another thing uh, on your Facebook page that you have to work with and deal with, and you know. Again, depending on how they're going to integrate um, Instagram into Facebook, uh, I haven't heard any details about how they're going to do that yet. So that remains to be seen. But I don't know. I'm kind of on the uh, on the negative fence. I don't feel like Facebook needs another um, another service. I kind of feel like it's be it's going the way that MySpace went. You know, it became too bloated and, and too much, and you know, it's just too much. Uh, more and more people that that I know are making the conversion over to Google Plus. Uh, if you have, the, the way that I, I compare Facebook and Google Plus is if you have a smartphone and you don't have a computer, Google Plus is kind of where you want to be. The app, the, um, the iPhone app is much, much simpler to use um, than the Facebook app. However, if you don't have a smartphone and all you have is a computer, Facebook is definitely where you want to be. Uh, because on the, on the computer, it's Facebook is more of a um, um, an enveloping uh, kind of experience. It kind of you know draws you in and surrounds you a little bit. Um, the, the Facebook app is a little bit confusing at times, can be. Um, though I still use Facebook as my primary social network. Uh, I am a, I am on Google Plus also, so I do use that. I tend to like it a little bit better because, like I said, it's much easier to use and to get around um, Google Plus than it is Facebook on uh, on the iPhone. So that's really kind of all I, I got on that. Is why I just kind of wanted to get that news out there, kind of throw my opinion in. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below um, in the comment section of this video. I also put an article up on the blog at hdemarzo.blogspot.com that you can click on over and take a look at. I will throw a, a link down below in the show notes to, so you can just go ahead and copy and paste that into your browser and check out the blog. Um, if you have, if there's a, a uh, an app or a social network that you use that um, that we don't really know about, go ahead and, uh, and spread the word so that, so that I can, you know, again, take, check it out and spread the word to you guys. Because that's what this whole social media thing is about, you know, community and sharing thoughts and commenting and spreading the word so everybody can 
benefit from the good and watch out for the bad. So until next time, keep it real.